This is by no means going to be my best video. It's by no means going to be my worst though either. <laughs> What's happened? The Chancellor's been elaborating on a plot by the Jedi to overthrow the Senate. Our convention occurs at a moment of crisis for our nation. The attacks on our police and the terrorism of our cities threaten our very way of life. There can be no prosperity without law and order. I am the law and order candidate. I am your voice. Beginning on January 20th of 2017, safety will be restored. We will make America strong again. We will make America proud again. We will make America safe again. And we will make America great again. Man, there's a lot going on in the world. I figured I'd get this video out, but I forgot about this video because I forgot about these books. And now I gotta get this video out before there's like a trade embargo against them or some shit. Got the black and white versions of Red Sonja number zero. These are books that I made before my last video because these are the ones that inspired that video. Because I was like, Man, if I could just, like, do that, but have it on videotape and find those books and, like, record it, that would be a pretty dope-ass video. Now, I, I don't know if I have to have a passport to go to the next city or not, but... I always wanted that as, as the Wizard Max one half foil purple. Yep. I found I got Knuckles number one, so I figured I'd get two and three. Y'all don't mind my messy desk. I was looking for my passport. Um. Teen Titans Go. That's a run I'm trying to get. Don't judge me. I like these childish books. It's childish pleasures. Number five. Stoked if I can find these two. Six. Twelve. No particular order, obviously. Four. I found this because I'm a sucker for a redhead. Because, you know. Chin just got to stick together. Especially in these dire times. Convention sketchbook. And then I found this because y'all was paying a lot of money for this. And I'm not. I found that's like my 15th fucking copy of that book. And this one too. And then y'all had this, and I want to get it. I'm gonna get the whole run of this because some of my Michael Turner made Wonder Woman's boobies bigger than they normally are. But tell me that Michael Turner ain't cold. Tell me that Michael Turner. Robin, what the shit? I don't have to move these out the way, cause. Oh, you see the messiness of my desk. You see all this shit in here? That's, that's a light. That's some tape. That's some fuck shit. That's other shit. It's, it's really none of y'all's business. You see my schedule, though. It's very empty. If y'all need to pin me in for anything, I'm good to go this month. January is not a busy month for me. Oh, I found that. And on top of that, I was like, well, maybe they got number two. Yeah, right behind that. And then they had number three. And then they had number four. See, this is the same used bookstore from the Walking Dead book set. I was like, well, if I find all this shit, if I'd have got that, all this on videotape, because you'll see some other books in a minute. That would have been cold, because, I don't know, I got lucky, I guess. It's a pretty good spot, though. Ask Archangel. He'll tell you. I was like, no, nah, they're not going to have a run all the way to nine, are they? Because nine's the first appearance of Angela. Oh, they had a run all the way to 50. But I stopped at nine because I 
damn, these books take a while, take up a lot of room. I found the evil Ernie calls blue chick with tape over titties. Man, this was 50 cents, and it was sold out every time, you know, I went to go get it before. And this, I don't know why I thought this was the one. I thought this was the one that I wanted, which was, I don't remember why I wanted it at the time. At first, Hellboy or some shit. It was number two. Maybe number one. I don't know. Anyways, I'm just ranting and raving right now. But. Nah, 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 nah. The same day. I found. Oh, there went those Lady Killer number one. It was only Snot Girl. She's dirty, anyways. Dirty bitch. And then I found. Nah, 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 nah. This right here. Okay. Devil May Cry. That's the Michael Turner variant. That is arguably one of the, it's not a, it's not, it's like a $20 book, right? Try to find it. You ain't gonna find that bitch. You're just not gonna find that bitch. I don't know why you're not gonna find that bitch. But you're not gonna find that bitch. I don't know. I'm gonna hit you up with an act of kindness. First of all, well, no, we gonna do this first. Alright, this from Triple C, my boy. Look, man. I made a video with these in it. And it wouldn't upload. Wouldn't happen. But he sent me these because I, I said, can you look for these? And then like a day later, he's like, oh, I found all those books. Really? Because, really? Because I've been looking for them for two years and you found them in a day? Really? I thought I was good. If you need a book, the triple C's your guy. Really? A day. You know? I can't even have hit look like that. And then he got me. Okay. My grail. My holy grail. My, my One of my books on my wish list for every year. Detective Comics. Which Detective Comics, you ask? First Prince of Batgirl. I'm just I'm just chilling at the house one day and I get this package and I'm like, oh, oh, look, look, look. Triple C sent me my holy grail. I don't give a fuck what you think. That right there. First Prince of Batgirl. Nah, 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 yeah. And it comes with Batgirl. Lego Batgirl. Can't even fuck with that. Mm. That's the most thoughtful thing anybody's ever done. I mean, right off the bat, I got to find him. First Prince of Punisher. Couple of us, this is in my last videos I wanted to reiterate on. Just because I don't know if y'all know. This right here. Like a twenty thirty dollar book on eBay. Sub zero. Right here. I know. Y'all like animated, whatever. First of all, for you completionists, it has a Harley Quinn appearance in it. It's an advertisement, but it's a Harley Quinn appearance. I'm a completionist for Harley Quinn. Second of all, that's a hard goddamn book to get. Because you had to not only send in the UPC for the movie, then you had to send in four UPCs from Orville Redenbacher's motherfucking popcorn or some shit to get the official. And then to get this thing, and I'm talking about, I'm talking about, can I zoom it? Can I get, can I get a witness? Look how, look how, that is a nine, nine, nine. 9.99. That is a peachy, fucking minty, crispy copy that you could only find in 2015 America. 
I found here in 2017. It was before the takeover, though. What y'all know about that? I know. Y'all don't like this animated, but I don't give a fuck. That's a hard goddamn book to find. And then, now I've showed, now i got these, okay. Now there are different versions of these. Arguably, the hard version of this to find it. Boom, boom. Batman Ghosts, right? Halloween specials. There's a lot of versions of these. But that one right there. And then I wanted to come at you with the Batman Arkham. I showed it, but... That's a hard book to find. Not only is it a hard book to find, it is a fucking weird good fucking story though and it has death in it I think it's an early death appearance too like maybe your only appearance in a Batman but I don't know it's fucking crazy artwork in it changes from page to page because you're going through Arkham it isn't even really a Batman story it's kind of like all of them sitting back talking shit type of story it's got a George Perez cover I mean what more could you want and then that's the last issue of Batman and Robin Adventures Optimus Batman right there <clears throat> then we got the Batman Confidential did y'all take a glimpse at this okay that cover fucking hard but not only is that cover hard that story is hard I also found out for a dollar because you ain't gonna find out for a dollar I mean first KG Beast I'm glad they didn't put him like they do in the in the comic book in the comic book the man run around in his draws he do KG Beast runs around in his draws yeah And then, 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 I don't know if I've showed this, but I want to show it again just because I need y'all to know how much I love Damien Wayne. Y'all don't like Damien. I don't give a fuck. I like Damien. Damien's a bad motherfucking Robin. That's his first appearance. I mean, he's an infant. He's, he's a baby. But that is his first appearance. Technically not, but, you know. He ain't named or anything, but you see little baby Batman in there. That's when, um, at least you know when him and Talia. Yeah, they did that in that book. That man tapped that ass from the backside in that book right there, making babies. That's what he did. Anyways, I'm gonna shut this down before the Department of Homeland Security comes and finds me. Well, obviously, I'm Batman's greatest enemy, no matter how much he may deny it. So when the studio asked me to be the main villain in this movie, I left it the chance to work with him again. I mean, let's face it, there is no Batman without the Joker. We go together like coffee and donuts, lapel flowers and rubber chickens, mayhem and destruction. And what I love about this movie the most is that it finally takes the time to explore my sensitive side. I mean, yes, I am a master criminal slash improv comedy genius, but... I'm also a nice guy. And once Batman finally realizes this, I won't be just smiling on the outside, I'll be smiling on the inside too. That'll be a nice relief. And nobody's got a smile like you, Mr. J. Thank you, Harley. Just wish Batman would notice once in a while. 